Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to Ted Lasso, Season 2, Episode 12, The Finale. So this is a full show request from someone on Patreon. You know who you are, thank you so much. I have loved watching these first two seasons and only one more to go, you guys. Again, there, fast. Um, I only started, what, two months ago? Pretty fast for these shows. Definitely since the episodes went up to like 40, 50 minute episodes. Which is crazy when it began with like mid, like 25 minutes, like so much faster to go through. It's taking longer to get through this season because out of nowhere it jumped up lengths for some reason. Don't know why. But I'm enjoying it anyway. I am scared for this finale of what's about to happen. No matter what happens though, I can't watch the premiere today. I'm going to have to wait till Saturday. So I have to wait a whole week to watch more. So I hope it ends off in a point where I'm not so devastated that I have to wait a week to see what happens. I guess we'll see soon enough. So thank you guys for watching with me and I hope you enjoyed this and here we go. Good morning, it's Friday. Oh, Glad you could what's join happening? Us. I'm your host, Jack. Have an update on those rumors of change at West Ham United. But first we turn our attention Wait, to West the Ham United. What's happening there? AFC Richmond, the club of our former foul mouth colleague, Roy Kent. <laughs> Is the news that Ted Lasso left in the middle of the Tottenham Oh no. Season, What's going on with the West Ham, though? Is that what I'm thinking it is? The panic attack. Clearly not fit to coach. Oh, let's on, don't say George. that. Be compassionate. Oh, yeah. Come on, Jeff. Come on. We're, we're panic attack doesn't mean you can't coach ever. You want to find a captain whose brain works, not some big girl. Mm, this asshole needs to fuck off. I miss Roy. <laughs> right? Roy would have shut it down. Oh god, here we go. It's gonna be a long day for him. Aw, fuck the haters. Oh, audio message. Hi Ted. Remember, the truth will set you free. Yeah. But first it'll piss you off. <laughs> Aw, think Doc. Aw. He has a lot of people that care about him. That's your first text you guys have? There's no previous text? Lord. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Is she like dating again? Yeah. That's more like it. Yeah. You have to set boundaries. Talk about your kid, check on each other maybe a little bit, but that's it. Really? Hey, fellas. Everyone just knows where he lives. Morning, Susan. Oh, are you alright, Ted? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Everyone's gonna ask that are you today. Sure about that? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Is Ted dead in the head, pink? This, this, I guess Europe, um, I was gonna say, aren't the best with mental health compared to like America at least. It's something I'll give us. We're very aware of it and much more sensitive about it. Hey, Wanka, if my father had a panic attack in Normandy, we'd all be speaking German. Okay, fuck you. Yes, sir. Just do the work, pal. You'll be alright. Aw, also kinda nice. What the fuck? <laughs> this dude. I assume you know what that was all about, yeah? Nope. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, love beard. Oh, those are lovely. Where are they from? Edwin Akufu. Oh. Sorry for your loss. Your loss? I'm still cool of him. You must have heard about your father's passing. I don't know if it's about that. But we will give Sam a very good home in Casablanca. Damn, oh. did Sam accept? Still. So, uh, Leslie. Any rumblings about which way Sam's leaning? Not a peep. Uh, so whenever I see him in a hallway, I just give him a cool nod. Oh, you know, yeah, like chill. Oh. oh, shit, that was cool. <laughs> I know, right? I saw it in a Denzel Washington movie, and I thought, oh, I'm taking that. Wow. I, Still, kids do that at school, like, right. every day. Hey, what's the story, Paul Shorey? Oh, Ted. Ted. No. Tell me about the article. No such thing as bad publicity, right? Though I think they might have been wrong about this. Yeah, maybe a little bummer because they were spot on with the whole beer before liquor thing. <laughs> and you know that you have our full support. Oh, that's great. I still wish I 
Well, don't worry. I'm going to speak directly to the owner of the paper and huh. see who this anonymous source was. <laughs> ah, come on, no news. Oh, we know though. Is, he knows. Said was true. And unlike Lieutenant Kathy, I actually can handle. Truth. How is he going to handle Nate? Well then, my is advice is treat no him differently. To after the match. Concentrate on the task in hand. Yep. Beating Brentford. Yes, because if we lose, it will kill. Don't. Me. Please don't lose. <laughs> hey, don't you worry, Hig Newton. I'm on it like. Hig Newton. Oh, God, he takes like shit. Oh. Yeah, well, it is a rough night, and I am now absolutely positive that I switched the salt. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, ew. Interesting. <laughs> hey, Rebecca, no. <laughs> Except that I love salt, I so. Place, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how you just... Oh, hello. <laughs> He is wooing him. Uh oh. Number 10. Oh, what's his choice gonna be? Is, uh, Roy, yeah? I don't hear any grunting. <laughs> hey, morning. Morning, Nate. Um, is Roy here? No. You seen this? Mm. Yes, I, oh, it's awful. Yeah, it was awful. Only a few people knew it was a panic attack, though. Yeah. Does Beard think it's him? Um, Jamie's looking for you. Oh, is he? Oh, no. Oh, this is going to be bad, too. Boy! Tom! Oh. Oh. What's going to happen? I'm nervous for Jamie. Yeah, okay. That's a good idea, because when I'm done, you won't have any teeth left and you'll need them for this <laughs> Damn. Right, uh, um, yeah. Okay, uh... <laughs> Better be good words. I ain't used to being around dead people. It just, it did something to me. That's reasonable. Emotionally. You got him in his but feels. Still, I shouldn't have done it and it was wrong. And he's apologizing. I just need you to know that I respect you. And wow. I respect you, I respect your relationship. And I will never ever wow. do anything like that ever This is again. very big of him. Yeah, you can't beat him up now. Fuck! <laughs> he really wanted to beat him up. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Say nothing. Sorry, I kind of froze when you two came in here. And I, I just didn't know what to do. Yeah, reasonable. Right. <laughs> but I don't think that you moderating a session between Coach Lasso and a celebrity psychiatrist is the best move right now. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> what? 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 Oh, okay, he seems happy. I want to talk to y'all about the article you saw in the paper this morning. Actually, y'all probably saw it on your phone. I think it's paper because hey, you can't cut cartoons out of a phone, right? Yeah, but you can screenshot them and text them. That's true. I hear he's a row, but my refrigerator has a television. Wow. Oh, that's a cool. I want one of those. <laughs> y'all found out about something that I chose not to tell y'all. Mm. That's dumb. They're your family. Y'all a team. Every single day. Am I really about to eat something called Greek yogurt? Mm. Yeah, gross. I leave my family and take a job halfway around the world. Me choosing not to be forthright with y'all, that was a bad choice. It's okay. I can't be wasting time wishing for a do-over on all that. Yeah. Because that ain't how choice Just got to move on. No, sir. Did I let Janelle Rhodes borrow my sophomore year because she spilled ketchup all over herself and it looked like she'd been shot? Mm -hmm. Well, those are two things I ain't ever getting back. <laughs> Every choice is a chance. And I didn't give myself the chance to build further trust with y'all. Oh. Quote the great UCLA college basketball coach, John Obi-Wan Gandalf. <laughs> what? It is our choice. Because I sure as heck wouldn't want any of y'all to hold anything back with me. No, we got you. You got you, coach. We got you. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, no problem, guys. <laughs> and when we sniff out the rat... Permission to take socks full of soap to their stomach and chest. <laughs> oh, damn. Yeah. Um, yeah, you better feel in the pressure, Nate. You Look, must feel like shit. Right now. Bud, not bud, coach. Yeah. It is? Yeah, technically, they've been in the bud. Horticulture, right? baby. Horticulture, <laughs> baby. Thank you. No, look, gentlemen, I want to focus. Yeah, I've got one. Yeah, Jamie, we got. What are we going to do that fucking thing there? It's still there. He hasn't moved it. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Okay. Well, tell you what, let's all head to the. And if you guys hustle, that'll count as our cardio for today, yeah? Scram! <laughs> whistle, whistle. <laughs> whistle, whistle. Come in. 
<gasps> Doggies. This is mascot idol. So oh, we'll, we'll find any mascots. Contestants? Will it be Macy Greyhound or Tina Fey? Oh, oh, so cute. Are they all from Barking and Palace? London's premier all-female dog breeder, Aww. Susie Campbell. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Huge fan. <laughs> oh, thanks. Okay. Huge. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Is now a bad time? It's a long um, handshake. No, uh, oh, sure. <laughs> wow. <laughs> She's really a big fan. Nice to meet you. The money people that back banter, they want to finance me opening my own PR firm. What? <laughs> Her own oh, firm? Oh, That's so I great. I need some advice. I'm, I'm flattered that you came to me. Yeah, it's really. Ted or Roy. Hey, or Rebecca. Kevin. Rebecca then. She's the one I'm afraid to tell you. Oh, yeah. I'm happy to be on the list. <laughs> yeah, you're on the list. You're up there. Well, look, it can be terrifying becoming a boss. No. I'm scared of telling Rebecca I'm leaving. Yeah. All oh, right, because she's cheating. Oh, <laughs> she's one of my best friends. Oh, yeah, geez. he's reading this way wrong. You leave trail on a level usually reserved for Greek mythology. No. No. I don't want to appear like I'm not grateful yeah. for the amazing opportunity she's given. She'll me. know. Just thank her. Tell her what a great opportunity it was. A good mentor, a great mentor, knows you will. Oh, oh like that's that. a good one. Yeah. yeah. Love wow. it. <laughs> I told you I do not cool. I think so. Huh? Yes. I don't know. It looked like it was raining, yet I don't see anything Crazy dropping down on him. Universe has always put me on the right path. The universe told me to marry your mother mm -hmm. and to buy Bitcoin in 2009. 2009! <laughs> <laughs> I love you. I love you. I guess let's keep an eye out. I sign you. There's one sign. This morning, Jamie apologized to me for what he said to you at the funeral. I didn't say anything. <laughs> I know. What did you do? What do you think I did? Punched him. <laughs> Headbutted him. Keep going. Did you murder him? <laughs> no. Worse. I fucking forgave him. It's disgusting, isn't it? <laughs> Why? It's very mature. I'm really proud of you. Fully support that. <laughs> Wait, I've got some news too. Oh, for fuck's sake, don't tell me Ted tried to get off with you. And <laughs> the VC opening my own PR firm. Holy fuck. Yeah, shit. it's great. That is huge. Oh, what? lift up. Whoa. <laughs> CEO and shit, that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> they're still so cute. Okay, now, now they feel like they're back in it. Compared to last episode, it's very weird. I'm not gonna have time for me anymore. Chat your poop now. Hmm. She'll definitely be busy if she shuts her own business. Second exchange. How's all that going? Uh, we broke up. Again? Oh, we're back on. Oh, God. It'll all wash out in the cycle. That's true. There'll always be uh, something else that happens. Thanks, Some celebrity. <laughs> yes, May. It's finished anyway. <laughs> we didn't open it when your mum moved back up north. <laughs> we didn't England got zero points in the Eurovision. <laughs> and we didn't open it when the neighbour ran over their own snake. <laughs> drinking it tonight. Duck. <laughs> Lizzie just sent over a preview of the Vanity Fair article. Oh, shit. Better not use any oh, pictures no. of me smiling. <laughs> like that exists. Yeah. <laughs> Is he gonna be like cut out of it completely? I didn't use any of the pictures for viewing them. That's fine though, it's about her. I'm so sorry for you. You understand. That is not cool. Don't you change a fucking thing. Yeah. You look powerful. Fucking gorgeous. I don't like that top feel. left photo though. Oh yeah? Roy's such a supportive boyfriend, I want that. You gonna say anything? Well, I mean, eventually, yeah. You may have noticed through the years that I can be quite loquacious. <laughs> no, to Nate. Well, you know my philosophy when it comes to cats, babies, and apologies, coach. You gotta let them come to you. All right, so he does know it's Nate. Happen. Yeah, Nate's... Some people need a little push. Nate's... Yeah, no, friends. Nobody. He's a wimp. I think it'll help. I'm afraid your mustache is gonna pop off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, he's very bad at letting it out and telling how he really feels. It's always a joke. Hi, babe. Hi. Mm. Have you got a second? I'm so sorry. No, don't be. Oh, they're both crying. It's good. They're not going to be able to hang out every morning and see each other every day. From the light and... No. <laughs> <laughs> Things are changing. Holy fucking shit. What? No, what? Rupert's just bought West Ham, you know <gasps> I knew it was something with the West Ham thing. And then he's getting Nate, isn't he? I think for a second I thought him giving me his shares in the club was a kind no. gesture. Of course it wasn't. You know, I'm actually quite reassured to find out that he is still just a yeah. selfish, conniving cock. <laughs> I mean, it does return a certain balance to the universe. It does. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's at equilibrium you, now. Not going work for him. Oh, Nate is though. He Shoot. can't afford me. <laughs> Richmond is my football club. You know that. Yeah, forever. You might not want to work with us. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> Hire your best friend. <laughs> oh. <Cute. laughs> I love the two of them so much. Come on, Richmond. Is it going to be after this game? Nate's going to tell them he's leaving. Maybe, yeah. Maybe we're not at the fist bumping stage right now. Oh. <laughs> he's feeling guilty as fuck. Because he better be. Right. If he isn't, he should be. Y'all good to go on run on today? Yeah? You'd be fools not to. Damn. You'd be fools not to, Lord. Yeah, we ought to give it a shot. Why change it now? I agree. Oh! Oh, he's back uh -oh. in the window. Did you get kicked out of your office again? <laughs> no, no, temporary. There's a carpet in there. It was absolutely covered in dog shit. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Been there, done that. Ew. Uh, use some... Uh, Advice. Oh. Uh, Advice. <laughs> wow. Hold on. Roy, are you saying you want to become a diamond dog? Yeah. Fuck no. <laughs> I'm just saying, I wouldn't mind being in the room whilst it fucking <laughs> happens. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> what? Diamond God, he's just, Nate's not into it as much anymore. He hates this shit. Yeah, you know, I'm just going to stay there. Okay, yeah. <laughs> You learn, right? Why is Nate such a so grouch? Right? Boy, didn't use a single picture with me in it. And it hurt. Wow. Feeling. Wow, his feelings were hurt. Yeah. Never happened. Year five, I have a rare smile allergy. Oof. Ooh. What is that? Not the that, same situation. Yeah. <laughs> the thing is, she looks so fucking great. On her own. Me. He doesn't want to be left behind. At Rebecca's dad's funeral, Jamie fucking Tart tells her he's fucking in love with her. Whoa. Yeah. And he's still alive? <laughs> Roy, we appreciate you barking at us. He's... Um, oh. There's something I uh, oh. have to confess. Oh, no. Oh, God. Here we go. Um, he's not going to do it, is he? Roy, when Keely and I went shopping the other day... Oh, he's going to confess to that. <laughs> yeah. Nate's just Talk fucking up everywhere. It. Is that okay? All Jamie did was talk to me and you wanted to kill him. I don't even at least want to headbutt me or something. You made a mistake, mate. Yeah, why do you want him to it. hit you? I deserve to be headbutted. I'd be happy to headbutt you, Nate. <laughs> okay, you know what? I think that's enough, right? Diamond Dogs dismount. <laughs> Nate, you're so weird. So sometimes the fucking Diamond Dogs is just chatting about shit and no one has to fucking solve anything. Yeah. Nothing fucking changes. Sometimes, yeah. Yeah, sometimes could just get it out. That's cool. <laughs> He's, he called them cool. <laughs> it's the 83rd class and there's never been more at stake. Brentford would believe that Richmond are still in their unusual mm. false nine court. I don't like it, Arlo. The last match of the season. For promotion. Last it's match. Funny time to be maybe it's not. this. Maybe this false nine is not working. Nate, would, Nate will be pissed if they stop it, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh shit, 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 shit. Oh. And that's 2-0 to Brentford. 
Impressive. Let's maybe change the formation. The all black suit. He's, Nate's going full villain, isn't he? I mean, look at it out there. Looks like a Renaissance painting portraying masculine melancholy. <laughs> it does. <laughs> we should abandon the false nine. It'd work if we had players knew what the fuck they were doing. It's not the player's fault. Yeah, I don't agree. You know, they just had 45 minutes to figure out what not to do. Yeah? Mm -hmm. What do you think, Roy? You should ask them. Yeah, true. See They're what they think. Out there actually doing this See what they think about the false nine. If they should keep it, if they know how to work it now. We stick with the false nine or switch it up. They've never been asked if they. <laughs> you should need to step it up and do it. Instead of hey, saying that they can't do true, it, right? let them try. Give them some motivation. For instance, Zoro, you should have saved that first goal. Girl. <laughs> He's being honest. Okay, it's been decided. <laughs> we'll stick with Hey, Captain. What's what's wrong? You gonna join us? What? Oh. Uh, it's been a while since someone touched that. Why is Nate? Ugh, the way he just like he's like ugh, rolling his eyes about this shit. So team, this is a family. We gotta work together. He just wants to be the solo star of this whole thing. Yes, Ted. Everything is okay. Don't have to be a bitch about it. Just checking in on you, cause you're what is it? freaking out or something, hmm? do? walking off. And then you abandon me. What? You didn't abandon you? Like you switched out of life just like that. What? And I, I worked my ass off. Because he's friends with other people. Back to prove myself to you. To make you like me again. This is your own insecurity. This is not Ted. The more, the more I did, the less you cared. He's going like through his own shit. Invisible. And now you're going to play Nate's false nine so when the team fuck up, which they will, okay, he can blame it on me. Well, no, fuck That's that. not what he's doing. Why are you reading into this shit? Everybody loves you. No, they don't. The great Ted Lasso. Well, I, I they tell him to fuck off all the time. And that means you wouldn't want a single match and they would have shipped your ass back to Kansas where you fucking belong with your, with your son. Fuck you. You sure as hell Fuck belong here. Fuck you. No, I do. I belong here. What? This, this, this You've been coaching for what? Right? I, I, One I, season, that's it? I know you didn't, but I didn't tell you how important you were to me enough. I'm sorry about that. No, no, you're not. You're full of shit. Just fuck you, Ted. Wow. He is like so angry and so hurt and has not said anything and just blaming Ted on ev for everything. Ted's going through his own shit. Good pressure from Rojas. Yes, you guys got this. That's hard. I'll be Come on, Sam. In. Yes! Yes! One more. And One more time. We got this. One more. Because even if they're in the tie, they, it's good. After a historically dreadful start to the season, are only one point out of second place. Oh, come on. Premier <clears throat> League. All they we got this. One we, got this. we can't have another time. loss where everyone's down. Find we finally have to have a win to the end of a season. Nice. From the Whoa. From the Dutchman. Tart is there. Yes, Tart. It's the moment for Richmond. Oh. Oh. Foul, foul, foul. It's a penalty. Yes, penalty kick. Jamie's got this. Yes. I don't jinx it like that. You've got this, Jamie. Do it for you. Do it for your team. Wait, is he gonna switch with Danny? You got this, Wow. He can't. He's he's giving the chance to Danny. He's giving the ball to Rojas. Wow. You got this, Danny. Jamie believes in you. Come on, Danny! Wow, why did Jamie do that? Just feel like he couldn't. He wanted to give Danny the shot. Go, Danny! Here we go, Danny! 
<laughs> Breathe, Danny. You got this. Oh, God. Let's hold on to the dog this time. Oh, this is deja vu from the first episode. Football is life. Football is life. Yes! 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 Richmond have got to finish in second place and will return to the Why is he so pissy about it? It's because he's going to be in another team now and he's pissed that they're going to be playing against them next year. Nation, and most of all, believe. I was promoted a time or two in my career, Arlo. It's a real achievement. Oh, you're happy, everyone is. You're in Will's part of it. Final score Richmond 2, Brentford 2, and the Jordan's hey. back. Oh, look at these two. Oh, yep. <laughs> you know why. <laughs> Headbutt and then hug him. That's a friendship there. Is he gonna... I don't think... Is he gonna be able to leave the team after this? They're like a real team now. A family. Nate's gone. What? D Nate... Took down and ripped the believe sign. What the fuck? Look what he was able to do with believe. God, it's time to make a choice. Richmond till we die, but well, Sam, I want to say Sam is staying. My gut is saying yes. Speak for yourself, yeah, but your tactical discipline. Hey. They are certainly going to miss you around here. He's not uh, leaving. Um, <laughs> I, I don't believe my time here at Richmond is over. And, and for that reason, I have to stay. Mm. Are we going to face this team next I season? I understand. You Nigerian motherfucker! Oh, damn. Whoa. Whoa, what? <laughs> Did not see that coming. Trash. Who the fuck do you the think fuck? you are wasting my time? You medium talent piece of shit. Damn. You medium talent? Now he knows he's made the right choice. my life to destroying you, you fucking asshole. Oh my god. You will lay on the Nigeria national team. Hmm. You understand me, Pinky Dick? Never. Oh, damn. I will buy your childhood home and I will take a shit in every room. What the and fuck? I'll a place down. <laughs> yeah, and I will sit here and I'll eat poop on the fucking ashes. I promise you. Wow. Okay. Yeah. I will never forget his disrespect. Fuck you, How is it disrespect? Fire. You gave him a choice. He made a choice. Oh, damn. This is so childish. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he, he knows in that moment he made the right decision. Here, I want to address the article written by our good friend, Mr. Trent Cram from the... Where is he? Where is he? What the fuck? Where's Trent? Or rather, I want to share with you all the truth about my recent struggles with anxiety. Trent would not be missing and this. What's going on? I'm over often and deal with mental health in athletics. That's a good topic of conversation. Champagne to celebrate? Oh, I'll just take a glass of water, please. Still no sparkling. Come on. Yes. Yes. Still. <laughs> you know, before living here, I used to just folks saying it's still water. <laughs> like it was water and it continues to remain. <laughs> of course you did, Ted. Well, there's no greater education than travel. Yeah. Hey, Very true. Rupert Rupert's bought West Ham United. Did it now. They're going to be yeah, rivals be now, nice foes. <laughs> Having our run ins with him being scheduled as opposed to his normal That's true. <laughs> You'll know when he's coming. Hi, Rebecca. Oh. And coach. Sorry. <laughs> No, no, no. Hey, Sam, go ahead. Stick around. I was getting ready to leave. No, no, no. no you... It's okay. <laughs> they think if you go, they might make out. Let you both know that I've decided to stay. Yeah. Ooh, took a breath away uh, there great. for a second. So I'm glad to hear that, Sam. Mm-hmm. Very glad. <laughs> How did in the middle. take the news? Not well. Um, not, not well. Mm -hmm. uh, he stormed off. Oh, shoot. I was really looking forward to that goodbye handshake from Francis. <laughs> yeah, no. Well, why did you decide to stay? Mm. 
I wish I could say it was because of my feelings for you. Oh, he's talking to her. But the truth is, I'm staying because it's what's best for me. Yeah. And my personal journey. There you go. It's what you need. This is for you. No other reason. It's a good reason to stay. He was so talking to her. <laughs> you know, I think he might have been talking to you when he was looking at you. Yeah. Yes. yeah, we got that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, hell, you crushed that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's Trent. Coach Lasso. I was worried about you. I thought you might have been in a bike accident or something. No. Actually, I don't know how to ride a bicycle. Really? Oh. That surprised me. Why? It doesn't the surprise me. And the whole vibe? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> but why the heck weren't you at the press conference then? Because I am no longer a reporter. Oh. I was fired when they found out I revealed an anonymous source. Oh, wow. I, like, I didn't say anything, I promise. No, I know, Ted. I did. Oh. I'm looking for something different. Deeper. Here we go. Ooh. Good for him. Well, as the man says, he... But hey, you know what this makes you now, though, right? A friend. Trent Grimm, independent. I <laughs> love that. Yeah, my father made the same joke. <laughs> cool guy. Yeah. Well, I hope our paths cross again. Oh, soon. they will. As do I, Ted. I love our chats. Yeah, look at them. You want to ride? Good luck next season. Now it's just Trent Grimm, independent. Oh, no. <laughs> he left his keys in the car. Whoa, five days later. What's happening? It's the last of it. Yeah. Oh, moving out. And tricks well. The last day working in the same building, present. Oh, yeah. that's cute. Aeroplane tickets. Ooh, where are we going? You bought me aeroplane tickets? To my buyer. How did you get actual printed tickets? <laughs> From my travel agent, Kathy. Wow, She's old travel agent. Well, they still take paper tickets to airport. Yes, they still do. Like, is the Keely. penguin have them fellas? <laughs> oh my God, am I going to be able to smoke on the flight? <laughs> right. I love her. I'm missing the point. <laughs> By the sea, for six weeks. Six so weeks. you can chill out before you start kicking ass in your new job. That's nice. Vacation before and you I start. I the first holiday. I'm going to gorge myself to death on tapas. And it will take fucking ages. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. <Babe>. Thank you. <laughs> That's very nice. Let them have some couple time together. But I can't go. <gasps> oh, I had a feeling she was gonna say that. What? Weeks? We started like a week ago. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. That's why I made sure the place has got proper Wi-Fi and everything. <laughs> you can do shit from a balcony with the sea. But view. it is the beginning of her business. She needs to be there. But I can't. I just can't. It's understandable. It's hard. Honestly, well, you should go. I love a vacation, but not a spontaneous one the day before. I couldn't do that either. I need a plan ahead. Are we breaking up? Oh, no. whoa. I, I wasn't that? saying that, no. Well, I lock myself in a dark room and work nonstop. I'll see you in six weeks. That's a long time to be away. Okay. Why am I a little scared about this? Why? I love you. We'll be fine. Now I'm really worried because she said that. She's jinxing it here. Well, he's not leaving till tomorrow. You don't say goodbye like right at this moment. <laughs> Three weeks later. Okay, only halfway through the vacation. Congratulations. What? What do you buy? Is it doing a restaurant? Nigerian restaurant? A Nigerian restaurant. I knew it. Good for him. He's getting his own business now. Starting to do what he loves and bringing home to him. Two months later. Whoa. It's been a while. This is West Ham. And Nate's the co- oh, Of course. Ugh. I knew it. Little bitches. Betrayal of the worst. Mmm, Nate. 
the but such a mm, uh, mm. oh neat just wanna fucking punch him god I, I, I knew this was happening I saw it coming episodes ago. the funeral ever since the funeral the funeral was really the when we whispered to him for Nate to betray him, though, and the whole team, after all they've been through and done for each other, and to go to Ted and basically tell Ted he's awful, he's a awful coach, awful human being, he's just shit, and then just rip up the belief sign and leave to go to a rival. What the fucking kind of shit is that? Nate is wrong in every way. Yes, Ted was really nice to him, helped him out. But Ted was also going through his own shit. He's helping all these other people out on the team, too. And sorry, he can't give you attention 24-7. You're not his child. He actually has a child in another country to deal with. That's, like, so you need so much attention and he can't give it to you. So you hate him and blame him for everything that's wrong in your life. He's just projecting his problems and putting them onto Ted. And it's just, mmm pisses me off. I'm sorry. Um, I'm happy for Sam. He's staying, though. Happy that Sam's staying. And next season, I guess we're gonna be facing Nate and Rupert. I hope... Fuck them. hope they lose every game. We gotta destroy them next season. We have to. And then hopefully... I don't know what's gonna happen. Roy and Keeley, just every time they feel like they're close, they pull apart. He go on this vacation without her. I don't know what's going to go on with them. With her getting busy starting a whole business, which is, yeah, it's going to be busy. And Roy, he's got to accept that she's going to be very preoccupied for a while. For a long while. But also, they've got to find a way to keep their relationship strong and sturdy even during that. And I don't know, it, I think they're really going to have to fight hard for it. And if not, I think it's going to be a little harsh for them next season. I guess we'll see. All right. Thank you guys for watching so much. I can't wait to start season three. Oh, fine. one more season, you guys. All right. I hope you guys have enjoyed my reactions to all of season two. Go check them out right now. Uh, they're all on, well, if you watch on YouTube, they're all on YouTube. If, the, if, you're, on, if you're looking at Patreon, check out all of them on Patreon too, on Uncut. And if you're watching on YouTube, I'm probably already done, or almost done, with the entire series. Because as of now, I think only episode, as of filming this, I think episode six or seven of season one is out on YouTube. And I think Patreon has season two, episode like five or six. I'm not like a full season, because uh, Patreon's been having a week, uh, a new episode of Ted Lasso basically every single week for months. And you guys get it about every other week, with a few exceptions. So they're, they're a good amount ahead. But yeah, go check it out. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this and are all having a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.